University of Houston has a lot of talent among its students and staff. However, some of those talents aren't always seen in the classroom, like the IT guy who also happens to be an accomplished Lego artist, Zach Tawatari, with the story tonight. Here in Pearland, art takes on many different forms. A UH employee is creating works using a beloved material, one piece at a time. In a place like this, a lot of times people call it the Lego room. On canvases like these, a familiar sound takes you back. My mom uh, and dad, they bought me Lego sets when I was much younger in the late 70s, early 80s. But for Gregory Jonasson, for me, it's, it's meditative to do this. This hobby, building large Lego sculptures and mosaics, is an art form. And I say I'm building or creating something, but my wife says I'm playing with Lego. There are no instructions. He makes his own. It's just a big matrix, X, Y, and you have to, I use a number of softwares. It helps that for 24 years, Jonasson has worked in IT at the University of Houston. Legos are the perfect combination, he says. Art and computer science. He's built masterpieces like this David Bowie. It's grayscale. It has 35,840 elements uh, or dots on the front. And you can see his work in places like Bush Airport museum exhibits. He's even been commissioned. When we build these creations, there's some level of satisfaction that we have inside, I think. Just down the street, his work is showcased at this local store. It doesn't have to hang on the wall uh, to be art. Greg's dream is for Lego to display his work. The biggest payoff of, of anything um, is just to have people look at it. Until then, he'll keep building brick by brick. You can see it in the expression. It's just uh, priceless. Zach Tawatari, KHOU 11 News.